are turned in here tonight. That is what they will be. EA Sports. It's in the game. This is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, Jim. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you wanted to be like Bruce Lee. You wanted to be that fast. You wanted to be that charismatic. You wanted to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity of the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem at the bar to stay undefeated. Right. If you could do that, you could do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. Bruce Lee. He is ready to go. That means so early for our main event of the evening. And now our fill the tape for this heavyweight fight. All right, now for the official introductions. We go to the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> for this one. Well, so much UFC history has taken place here in Abu Dhabi, and plenty more where that came from tonight as we return to the Eddie Hot Arena. This place is beautiful. Kind of reminds me of the Superdome a little bit. Yes, but... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, outside of the color of the Superdome, it is not up to par with the Eddie Hot Arena, but you make me take a shot at my own team. But yes, absolutely stunning venue, and the fights have been top-notch here. Attempt there blocked. Oh. Didn't see that one coming. Gets tagged with a nice combination to the head. Oh, the roundhouse kick lands. He does a great job of getting that leg kick to the target. So he's dealing with some swelling upstairs, and you got to think his opponent is going to continue to attack that region. Well, he has to. He's starting to see now the work is being done. He's starting to see the benefits of the work with the swelling that's starting to occur. I want that takedown now. Just out of range with that strike. All right, so a good series of kicks by him there. He has mixed it up beautifully, I think, on the feet tonight. He is kicking everywhere tonight. He's doing a fantastic job. Two minutes have gone by. Oh, nice jab up top by Lee. Oh, and he lands another combination here, really starting to get into a striking group. I mean, and stringing them together so effectively, never throwing the same attack more than once. What a job to recognize all the openings in his opponent's defenses. All right, so some definite damage underneath the elbow now on the side of his opponent. A lot of strikes to the body starting to start add up. Yeah, a lot of strikes to the body and mixing up the attack, not being one-dimensional, not head-hunting inside the octagon. I, I think he has fought beautifully right now. Oh, that's the biggest shot of the fight. 
fight thus far. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. It might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. That leg kick hurt. Well, I'm no fighter, but if I rock a guy to that extent, I feel like I'm closing the show. Absolutely. You got to go close the show if you get a guy hurt that bad. And not that long and take your time. He's right for the picking. Go and pick the fruit. <laughs> Back to his feet. Ninety seconds and counting here in our opening round. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, big left. Went for the inside leg kick. One minute. Ooh, he lands a kick to the leg. Heavy leather landed on both sides in that exchange. And doing work with the jab. All right, so a little wealth there starting to develop on the side of his body. A lot of strikes landing in that area tonight. I mean, he's got to do something. You cannot continue to ignore that you're getting hit in the body over and over again. You better address it now before we get to a point where you can't continue to fight. And he blocked the punch there. There's the end of the round. I'm looking over to my left, UFC President Dana White. I think he's making out the bonus check right now. Incredible back and forth action. Sign the check, boss. These two young men deserve 50,000. Hell, let's give them each 100,000 for the performance that they just put on in one round. Both were hurt. Both were able to withstand the punishment, and I can't wait until the next round gets started. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that round. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting it over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent. Ready. Ready. Go. Second round underway. All right, so after one of the more entertaining rounds in recent UFC history, our next round is upon us. Man, those guys both took some serious damage in that previous round. They both took some damage, but they both gave it. They both gave it as well as they took it. Let's see who quilts and goes down first. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Well, he's always working off of that jab. Nice jab there by Lee. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Well, the more things change, the more they stay the same. He continues to land a high volume of strikes on his opponent at will. Well, I mean, John, the guy can fight everywhere. And he can fight everywhere. He's got a huge strike right there. I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he landed. Great job. Just misses with the jab there. That was a big check. Oh, looking to land the leg kick, but unable to find the target. Back and forth we go. Well, you can sense the corner frustration. He has not. Oh, oh he's stunned bad. He's got to grab him. He's got to recover. Huge left hand. Looking to establish the jab here. Nicely done by Lee. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. Just over three minutes to go. Oh, lands another shot to the body. Beautifully played.
placed as he continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Dig and kick. The issue with that kick, as effective as it is, one gets checked out the Anderson Silva situation. Nice head kick, man. His nose is bleeding now. Yes, looks as though he got cut by one of those offerings from his opponent. Oh, big punch land. He lands a switch kick there. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace, an uptick in the aggression, and a huge connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Under two minutes now to go in round two. Well, I think I can smell the blood at this point in time. That canvas didn't look like that a few fights ago. Blood is flowing from that cut with every passing strike. Every strike. And it burns. John, it burns so bad. When you get cut like that, every time a shot lands, it just burns. So this guy needs to try to find a way to not take and limit the damage. Oh! Yeah, he hurt him real bad. He still hurt. Left hand lands upstairs. Oh, nice body shot. That knee might have landed there. Oh, body shot. Unable to land with that punch. Well, you know this is the hurt business, and both guys are compromised at this stage of the fight. Yeah, both guys are compromised. Both guys have been beat up. Both guys have done a great job of landing, recognizing what they wanted to get done, and it's showing. This is a very evenly matched fight. Keep your hands up, let's go. All right, 45 seconds now to go on the round. Oh, nasty cut there, right on the bridge of the nose. by Lee. 20 seconds left. Big shot to the head. Nasty body kick downstairs. All right, so there's the end of the round. Big story in this one now. The cut on the bridge of that nose from that strike. The cut man is in there. Should be able to shut this one and potentially prevent it from being a factor here moving forward. Well, his nose is just mangled. The cut appears to be the big issue. Let's get you some replays from that previous round. I mean, he's getting hammered. He's going back to the well over and over again. And why would he not? His opponent wasn't good on the defense. His opponent allowed for him to land too clean. And now, he's just targeting that cut on the nose. You ready to fight? Ready. Third yeah. round underway. All right, next round is underway. And if you look at these two guys in between rounds, it looks like they've barely broken a sweat, both with good resting heart rate, stamina still very high. And you just have to laud the efforts of these guys in training. Both men certainly noted cardio specialists, but incredible that they would have this much in the tank after 10 plus minutes of fight. Well, we may have the best cut men and women in the business, but I'm not sure they're gonna be able to do much with that cut. It continues to widen with every passing strike. And you're fighting a great fight. It's hard to deal with the damage of the cut while dealing with the level of the fighter in front of you. Right now, you've gotta do something different to try and change the way that this fight is playing out. Jab yet again out of range. Turn it around. Oh, nice. And 
once again looking for that highlight reel KO with that front kick. Lee's blocking well now. You see the fighter raise the guard to protect that obviously damaged nose. Just unable to quite find that range. Because of redness on his body, man. Another powerful kick there. A lot of volume with the feet tonight for him. It's unbelievable to watch the body make kicking the base of their fighting style. He has shown us that it's possible. Tried to... Oh! He's hurt bad. Oh! Big right hand there. left hand so we have crossed the midpoint in this one good job defensively to block that punch Lee's nose is just pulling blood right now I'm no doctor Daniel but I'm not sure that thing isn't broken right now throws the teeth now and it lands well, now these kicks are really starting to pile up since he found his range. This could be trouble. Well, you've got to admire the urgency here. He is trying to keep the judges out of it. Lighten up his opponent left and right. Well, that calf is starting to show signs of bruising now. And you can tell in the way that he's walking. It's starting to take an effect. <laughs> Unable to connect with the right. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Nice kick. All right, well, if you like blood, perhaps this is the fight for you. That cut is really starting to open up wide now. It's starting to open up, and it doesn't seem to be affecting him too bad right now. It's still bloody, but it's not really limiting his, his ability to continue. Let's see if he can get through this and win this fight. Under a minute to go. Well, he is a tactician. He does not discriminate when it comes to his weapons. There's a sidekick. That sidekick can go to the legs or to the body. What a technique. Lee's cut is only getting worse, making a nice donation to the canvas tonight. And there's a takedown attempt. Good job by the defense to prevent that shot from getting through. Under 20 seconds now to go. Can't take many of those, you better check. Final seconds. Oh. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. All right, we're going to stay with him and follow him back to the corner to the stool because that is a really severe cut that he is dealing with. We'll see if the cut man can stem the bleeding here. All right, well, I'm no doctor. I'm not going to diagnose a broken nose, but a huge cut on the bridge, and his opponent continues to attack it. Continues to attack it as he should. He did the damage. He was the one that landed the shot that opened up that cut. Now he's got to make his opponent pay for it. He was a bit lax in the defense, and now... He's got that massive cut on the bridge of his nose. You ready to fight? Ready. Go All right, here's round four. Fight scheduled for five, five minute rounds. Lee gets hit with a kick. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Lee gets absolutely tagged by that stiff jab. And working that jab again. So a big knockdown for him in the previous round. Confidence is high and building here in this next round. Confidence is key. And he has oh, what a power 
power strike there, he could be in trouble. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. He doesn't know if he's in the octagon or at his mama's house for Thanksgiving. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Knock him out. The fight's done. Well, he's landed a few big uppercuts already. I will bet you $1,000 he sets it up again here. You're not taking my money, J.A. That uppercut is coming. And when it lands, it's going to land and land very damaging. Lee's nose is unrecognizable. It is mangled. It is cut open. I think it's probably broken at this point in time. Surgery next week. But now we'll see if mentally, physically, he can stay in this fight. Lands a quick jab. Drives the shit into the rib. Great body kick. Well, you know, Rogan's pissed he missed this one. We are witnessing an instant classic. Back and forth we go. Both fighters have been on the cusp of being finished, and both have exuded a ton of heart. Yeah, they both show heart, courage, ability, technical skills. I can't really tell you how these two are still in the fight with the damage that they both are exhibiting on their face. Oh, great block there. Three minutes to go. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault, and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. Oh, big head kick there. Oh, so the taller fighter lands a flush knee. Back and forth we go. Well, the crowd can get over the top. This fight's going to be over, DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent thought he was going low. And now he's got him hurt very badly. Nice. Nice connection with the right hand. Well, when you're dealing with a cut like that, it may not be long before it starts to impact the breathing. Not a good spot to be in here. Perfect execution as he gets the single leg takedown. Yep, and he's got him secured in the half guard now. All right, close guard now. Oh, good ground and pound here. When he gets up, he is back on the feet here. Oh, boy, look at that gas. Right idea, wrong execution. The counter right is no good. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Able to block that one. Come on, buddy. Keep your hands up. Let's go. Looking to land the leg kick now. What? Under a minute now to go in the round. Well, that strike landed. Not going to help that cut. All right, so the ref is going to step in here and call on the doctor to look at what is a now mangled nose. This could be the end of the fight. It could be the end of the fight. There's a lot of blood. The blood's going down into the mouth. I mean, the nose could be broken. Crowd getting a little bit restless. Doctor has to tune out that noise, but at least for now, they will allow him to fight on. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, well, this fighter was bullish in his desire to continue, and the doctor is going to afford him that opportunity as the referee gets us back underway. This guy's a fighter, man. This guy doesn't want to lose a fight on the stool. He wants an opportunity to go out there and go out on the shield. And that's exactly what he's getting. He's getting a chance. And as a fighter, that's all you can ask for. And you know fans start like Dr. Stoppages, so they are thrilled. They start booing. And sometimes guys' eye is hanging off the side uh -huh. of his head. Lee's an absolute mess right now. There is blood everywhere. I wouldn't be surprised at all to see them call in the ringside position between rounds. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Lands a nasty body kick. Buzzer sounds for the end of round four. Man, this fight has been pretty wild. A lot of high-octane output on both sides, and 
candidly, neither fighter looking too good here. <laughs> it's the output. I mean, both of these guys have got their foot on the gas from the start of the fight. They've worked really, really hard to get to where they are right now. They're both going to have to rely on the toughness to drag them through the very difficult moments. All right, and being told we've got some replays from the previous round, and it appears as though the cut on the bridge of the nose is getting worse by the minute. It's getting worse by the minute, and he's got an opponent in front of him that wants to target it. He wants to hit him on the nose over and over again. I wonder if every time he gets hit there, the blood goes down into the mouth, making it difficult to breathe. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. Fifth and final round. Let's finish this. Effective with the jab. He's just being more aggressive, and because he's being more aggressive and more loose with his strikes, he's landing. Another strike to the body, really starting to pile up these body shots here in the latter stages of this fight. You didn't see a lot of that in the earlier rounds. Make it up for last time here. Oh, big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he needs to try to chase down that fish. Shades of Robbie Lawler versus Rory McDonald as these athletes go toe to toe, both dealing with cuts and adversity and trying to fight through it. Absolutely incredible result. So many people say they want to be a fighter. If I'm trying to convince somebody not to do it, I will show them this fight. This fight has been amazing. These guys have laid it all out on the line. I wonder now who's going to be the first one to take a backward step. Just a nasty leg kick. That one hurt. That's more than I mean, he is throwing those kicks with evil intent. He is trying to break his leg with every single kick. Oh! Throwing that jab now again, the fighter of eights. Oh, caught him with the head kick. They're going at it here. Huge shots landing on both sides. Lee's really making things difficult for the opposition right now, continuing to target that damaged nose, and that last strike absolutely found the target. Well, at this point, hard to blame him for head hunting, right? He has caused some significant swelling upstairs and continues to attack that area to great effect. Absolutely. I mean, the guy has done a great job recognizing where he had in it. Oh, 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 he is officially rough. A big, massive hook that really has put his opponent on skates. All right, he's been very clean with his hooks on the feet here tonight, and it's the way he set it up that has really impressed you. Yeah, it's A lot of blood now, and yes, the doctor is going to be called in. The referee pauses the action. His nose is absolutely mangled. It's smashed. He's huh. done a great job of smashing that nose, pushing it back, and you see the blood coming down the face into the mouth. But it should not affect him being able to see his opponent in front of him. I'm not even sure how the doctor's going to be able to find that cut under all the blood, but he did, and it looks as though, given the location, he's going to allow the fighter to continue, at least for now. All right, so some pretty significant adversity here, but the fight is going to continue. The doctor has left, and the ref gets us back underway. Gets us right back underway, and it doesn't seem like there was too much thought into it. It looked like they were going to let him fight. That's exactly what they did, and I could not be happy. Oh, man. That... I'm not sure how he stayed upright. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, to stay standing shows and talks to your toughness. Down the clean. Going back to his patented kicks here, but unable to find the target there. All right, so he's landed a few semi uppercuts already, DC. Got to think he goes back to it. I am almost certain. Roundhouse now just misses. Put him up. 
Sidekick. Well done. Big shot lands for both guys. What an absolute war it has been. Probably going to hold up in the fight of the year conversation. It just takes me back to certain fights. It takes me back to Michael Johnson against Justin Gaethje. Justin Gaethje versus Michael the best fights in the world is what I think about when I look at these two. From the blood, from the damage, to the heart and the spirit that these two have shown. I cannot believe that these guys have made it to a minute left in the fight with that type of ability. He's brutalized him with the ground power. This fight is close to being done. Gotta be careful, Alba. That is tight. Position, might still be able to get a submission here. Oh, back and forth action right till the final horn. What a tremendous finish to this one as we go the full 25 minutes. The official decision is in. It resides with Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. Judge one scores this contest, 48-46, Pantera. Judge two scores it. 846 Lee and Judge 3 scores it 8846 declared the winner by split decision Pantera Wow so there he is your winner by the narrowest of margins only three scorecards in the world matter two of them thought he won I mean you could tell that he wasn't sure he had got enough done to win the fight he gets the decision it was a very close fight and it's well earned